Hello everyone, welcome to Building the Ultimate Matchbox Card Collection. My name's Tyrone. This is Wave 1 or Mix 1 of Matchbox Collector Series for 2024. Interestingly, uh, the first five of this year are numbered 1 through 5. I don't think that's ever happened before. Maybe somebody with a logical mind has taken over at Matchbox. We'll see if it continues. 1994 Mitsubishi 3000 GT first off. Uh, almost all of these castings I'm going to show you today are fairly new. Fairly new meaning a couple of years around the traps uh, except one. But we'll get to that. Here is the Mitsubishi at number three. Now uh, there's the back if you get any information whatsoever. Freeze frame. And there it goes, straight in the bin. There it is. I saw a TV show, um, what do they call that? English show, they go to America and do up old cars. Only recently, it was a rerun, but uh, they did up one of these in this color. And it was amazing to see how many gizmos were included in this as a um, production car. All sorts of responsive things to make it sportier. The wing mirror, or the, the wing on the back and all sorts of things. Uh, Matchbox collectors, you get rubber tyres and a cool box. I keep the box so I don't keep the packaging. Uh, it's Buddies. Well, this year, 2024, came in that one. Obviously plastic tyres, but that's alright. And was it the red one just before that? And then, of course, the black one. Or the red and the black might be the other way around. Gee, that rolls so nicely. Not that the others don't, but you get that rubber tyre feel. So that's a good start. We'll put those off to the right. They had a. Yeah. Alright, I'll we'll put this guy in shot. But we'll do a pan around. Bugatti. Number two of the first five, 2018 Bugatti Devo. And they've followed up with a matte paint job. The, well, we've had, I'll show you. We've had a bunch of matte pa paint jobs on the Bugatti. This one continues the theme. Yeah. That's sweet. Check out the details just behind those headlights. I've used those wheels on a few other things before, but they really suit this one. Almost blacked out windows to continue the contrast. Black on matte blue. Okay, that's a really nice addition. And of course, last year we had the 70 years edition and again I can't remember that far back was it the blue or the black first up I can't remember either or nice really nice so that's the second one not really because I'm muddling up the numbers but that's all right I'm allowed to it's metal that's not allowed to we'll put the box over there yeah. and get right on with number four the Lexus 2022 Lexus LX. This is only the second color of this. I'm sure um, we'll get many more, but let's look at this one. Strange green. I'm guessing that this was a product or is a production color. Yeah, not sure about that color. Not sure at all. I mean, you can't have only regular colours on everything. Life gets a bit dull. Would I choose a car of this colour? Not in a million years. It comes with the chunky rubber tyres. There was the first and only other one in white. Plastic tyres. They look good together. Hmm. 
yeah, that colour. <laughs> cool wheels. At the first glance, when I took them out of the box this morning before the video, I thought this was a Subaru Forester because it, on its own it looks quite small in that colour. But on a secondary glance, I realised it was the Lexus, the Big Mama Lexus. That's the third one. Get over there. You oh, there's the box. Do you even care about the box? They're all a bit of yeah. I keep them. Uh, the one that isn't like the others, this 55, 1955 Ford panel delivery, um, it's not like the others because there are quite a lot of it. I'll show you in a second. It's number one of 20 for 2024. Yeah, all the others are really quite new to the scene, but not this old fella. Read all of that if you can on your mega wall. That's nice. That's nice. I like it. Here are the others. Or at least the others I have. There are many more out there. I'm working on it. <laughs> when uh, I get anywhere near close to having the other, all of the others, I'll show you. But not there yet, folks. Oops, you too. Get out. Get out. Yeah, that's a, a winner. And the fifth and final one today is actually my favourite of the lineup. It's the 2023 Nissan Z. I saw a real one of this just yesterday. It was white. I was stuck in traffic with it. Uh, for about half an hour actually. I was on my way across town and there was a very wide load being escorted down. All of the highways I used couldn't get around it. Um, we've got a very large mining industry here in Western Australia. Um, it supports about 50% of the nation's exports um, or contributes 50% to the nation's exports. So when they're moving their stuff around everybody waits. And uh, if it's driving your economy, yeah, you have very little reason to complain, apart from being late sometimes. But back on story, I was shuffling around in the lanes like everyone else when they get frustrated, um, and I wound up behind one of these for quite some time. And I wasn't particularly impressed with the back of it. It's not radical. Like when the Z first came out, you know, it was like, holy smoke, but this is very conservative. And then as we all shuffled in our little traffic dance, I got to see all the other angles and that's the least impressive. And then you get the roof line and those crazy cool headlights, the big grill. And then you think, yeah, that's a cool car, but straight on from the back, not so much. Let's do the warrant of fitness, see if things open and close properly. I don't have a problem with uh, 2023 or 2024 matchbox with opening parts. Very few things, but certainly not this one. Everything works tickety boo, and uh, only two to show you because only two have been made so far. Well, three now. Don't they look good together? That was the Mattel Creations, and that was the Moving Parts, wasn't it? I'm sure we'll get another one just this year, in fact. They like to do that, and we like to buy them. Ooh, I like that. I like that. All right, as promised, we'll do the pan around. Um, mm, yeah, yeah. Da -da class photo. Uh, you can go there. Got to get the colour mix right. Yeah, that's it. Step back. Take it all in. So there you have it. 2024 Matchbox Collector Series Mix 1. Awesome. That's a great start. Let's uh, hope they continue with fabulous things like this for us. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Bye.